Hi, welcome to Easy Living New York. I'm Aaliyah, this is Matthew, and today we're going to be doing a review of Cork and Carrie's Cocktails to Go. Okay, so Cork and Kerry has two locations, one in Rockville Center, which is where we went, and then there's another in Floral Park. And in today's video, we are going to be tasting the drinks on camera and giving our first impressions and thoughts. So C and K just had their first pop-up a few days ago, only serving drinks to go during the coronavirus pandemic so that their customers can social distance and enjoy their delicious drinks from the comfort of their own home. And for us, it was really important to support C and K during a time like this because we wanna make sure that our small local businesses are still thriving and making money. Um, so basically the menu was you can have they have this little menu that they hand out right there We'll put that on the screen so you can see it um, Each cocktail was $12 uh, or you get five for 50. They're also selling wine for $20 uh, Beers by the can for five and discounted whiskey by the ounce. It was 50% off the normal menu price So you got a bunch of these you have five of these and we're gonna try them out Let you know what's in them and let you know what we think about them. Here we go so the first one is going to be the breakfast old fashioned. It's right here, a little breakfast old fashioned. Cheers. Boom. All right. So this one has bourbon, coffee bourbon, maple, angostura, orange, and orange oils. And as soon as I opened this one up, I knew this was the breakfast old fashioned. You can even smell the coffee right away. Yeah, I love a good coffee drink. So let's see. Ooh, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Definitely coffee forward. I, I like do it. like it. I could definitely drink this. This is a coffee, or just the old fashioned. Yeah. But it's definitely got a little bit of the orange in there still. So it's not just super fully coffee. Uh, but I know orange and coffee kind of go well together. I've seen some videos of people doing like orange and coffee. So um, I feel like it's kind of unexpected. But... Yeah, but I think it's a combo that goes well together actually. So um, yeah, no, it tastes really good. And if you like it, because you hate old fashioned. Yeah. So um, I do. I genuinely do. But I also think it's got the maple in there. So it's a, it's a little sweet too. It's good. It's a really well-balanced drink actually. Um, if you like coffee, the two prominent barrels are the coffee and the orange. Yes, the both. I like both. <laughs> All right, so our next one is pina colada milk punch. I love a good pina. And that has rum, pineapple, coconut water, lime, and clarified whey. The whey. Whey. On the screen, you can see what it says. Whey. Yeah, it's not all juice. It's a little boozy. I keep saying a little boozy. Like, I'm a little boozy but... <laughs> no, it is really good. It's very drinkable. We'll go to our sideline correspondent. Now, what do you think? <laughs> Thinks it's the kind of drink that will sneak up on you. Okay. You heard so it juice. Sneak up. <laughs> yeah. Nice and chill. Yeah. Have a little kick. Yeah. Definitely have a little kick. Definitely a lot of pi uh, pineapple and coconut. Yeah. I would say more pineapple actually. I thought it was coconut at first, but it's definitely more pineapple. Pineapple flavor. flavor. Yeah, definitely more pineapple flavor. Really chilled. This is delicious. It is delicious. That's really good. Wow. But it will sneak up on you. Alright, so next up we've got the B Naughty. And that has bourbon, mezcal, black walnut, I'm assuming black walnut bitters, and orange blossom. Alright, let's see. Mm. It smells fun. It smells good. It smells kind of scary. said it smells scary. Does it taste scary? I don't really like mezcal, but it's drinkable. I love mezcal. You can definitely taste the mezcal. Alright, so basically it's very mezcal forward in my opinion. Um, you said you get some of the bourbon, but I think it's more mezcal forward. And I love mezcal, so if you like mezcal, you definitely like this. I think it's bourbon on the front, mezcal on the back. So next up, we've got the Artichoke Negroni, and that has London Dry Gin, Cardamaro, Cinar, and lemon oils. So the artichoke comes from the Cinar, basically. I smell the lemon. The lemon is really strong, actually. Oh! I love it. It's great. It's not 
for I'll me. I'll be taking that. <laughs> <laughs> it's not for me. If you like Negronis, it's basically um, it's it's a Negroni variant. So if if you like Negronis and you want to have a fun Negroni, it doesn't have any Campari in it. So like I said, it's a variant. Um, this Cardamaro Vermouth, I actually like it. It's really good Vermouth. So if you like Negronis, definitely try this one out. So last drink we have here is the Amelia Clarified Punch, and that has vodka, raspberry, elderflower liqueur, and again, clarified whey. I'm so serious. Like, oh my God. It smells good. Raspberry. You can definitely smell the elderflower. I think that's what that is. Oh, I like this. This is very unique. It smells so nice. This is, this is, this is very, very unique. Very smooth. It's very yeah. summery. I feel like this is real summery. It's gentle. Yeah, it's well, it feels like a lullaby. Yeah. No, this is really good. I will definitely order this again. You can tell by the name, it's very gentle. Amelia. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but all the flavors you complement one another. They go well together. Very smooth. Very easy. It's something light that you can just sit outside. Yeah. You know, on a nice sunny day and just kind of enjoy this cocktail. Very nice. I agree. It's really good. So when I was there, I asked some of the staff at uh, CNK, and they said they, they might be doing this in the future. They'll see how it goes. Hopefully, they won't need to. Hopefully, this, this whole quarantine will be over by then. But it was definitely a great experience just being able to go buy some drinks, take them home, and enjoy them with my fiance. Um, there are some other bars doing this right now in different parts of the city. There's Dante doing it in pretty much most of Manhattan. And if you want to see our review of Dante, you can check that out up top. And uh, we'll have a list in the description of some of the other bars that we've seen that are doing to go and deliver. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Bye.